Push the goddamn button. Push the goddamn button. Everybody subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Go ahead and click that red button right there. And also click that bell for notifications and select all. All right. Yo, 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 this is Gabe's Graphics. We are back in the building. With another GTA 5 mod tutorial for you, and today we are going to be installing the MLO Legion Hot Dog Stand Interior, alright? Uh, this one right here is like a little hot dog stand that is located near downtown Los Santos. And we are going to be installing this nice interior to it. Looks real good also. Shout out to the creator, which is Bamboozled. When you get down to this page, what you want to do is scroll down. Read the description. When you're done reading the description, you want to come over here and select the green arrow to download it. All right, whichever is the current one at that time, select the green arrow to download. Now, as of requirements, we are going to need Open 4. We will not be installing Open 4 today, although I will leave a link in the description to a video showing you how to install Open 4 if you already don't have it, okay? So um, feel free to check that out. If you don't have Open 4, make sure that you install that first, all right? Once you have Open 4 installed and you have uh, MLO Legion Hot Dog Stand Interior downloaded, on the left hand side I have a folder which is Legion Hot Dog Stand. That is the one we just downloaded. And inside that folder, we have uh, two different options. We have one for 5M and another one for single player. We are only going to be installing the single player today, okay? Now, let's go ahead and open up the single player folder. Inside the single player folder is going to have a folder and a readme, all right? We're gonna leave these right here and let's go over here to the right hand side. I have my Grand Theft Auto 5 directory opened up and ready. I have Open 4 installed and ready also, okay? So before we get to that, let's go ahead and go to our mods folder. If you don't have a mods folder, go ahead and create a new folder and name it mods, all in low caps. After you're done creating your new folder mods, go ahead and go to update and you want to copy this whole entire folder, update folder, and then you want to go back into the mods folder that you created, open it up. Then you want to paste the update folder right here that you copied earlier. After you do that, open up the update folder, then go to 64, then open up DLC packs. And this is where we are going to be dropping our folder. Okay, let's go back into our single player folder for our Legion hot dog stand. And let's take the folder that says INT underscore hot dogs. We want to select that folder drag and drop it over here to our DLC packs. All right. Once that has been dragged and dropped, we are good to go. Let's go ahead and open our open four. All right, now that we have our open four opened up, let's go ahead and navigate to our update folder that is on the side. Also make sure that you have your edit mode turned on. It's this button right here at the top. Make sure you turn on your edit mode first, okay? After that's turned on, Select update on the side column. Once you select that, then select update.rpf. Once you select that, a red banner is gonna pop up. It's going to say copy to mods folder. Go ahead and select copy to mods folder. If you already have it, then select show in mods folder. After that's been copied, select common, then data, then scroll down, find dlclist.xml, and then right click on it select edit this window will pop up you want to take the last item line make sure it's an item line and you just want to copy it place the cursor behind that line press enter on the keyboard and then paste that same line that you copied then you want to take the name of that folder int underscore hot dogs and you just want to paste the name of that folder right over the name inside the item line just like I did. So now we have a new item line that says INT underscore hot dogs, okay? Now let's go ahead and select save after that. Now we are all completely done with installing it. Let's go ahead and minimize any other windows that we have open and we can run the game. All right, when you spawn inside the game, you wanna open up your map and this is where it's going to be located at exactly right here 
All right, there's gonna be a pill box hill right down here located in downtown, all right? So that's where it's gonna be located at. As you can see, the Chihuahua hot dog is right behind me. Sausage farming since 82. <laughs> all right, and booyah, we got our interior for our Chihuahua hot dog stand. Man, this is cool right here because uh, this always been in the game, but we never been able to come inside of it, yo. It's kind of like uh, hookies, you know what I mean? Hookies always been in the game, but we weren't able to go inside. So this is cool now that we could have a actual interior with a Chihuahua hot dog. And we got some cool pictures of the Chihuahua hot dog van <laughs> on the wall. Uh, got uh, some neighbors, you know, some, some regulars up there. <laughs> you know what I mean? Got a couple of pictures on the wall, man. It's very interesting, man. It's cool. I like that. All right, and um, you have the tables. They got food and stuff. We got the old school um, style type of like um, cafe chairs. You know what I mean? Like the open 24-hour cafe chairs, the ones that are all worn out. <laughs> all right, uh, we got a kitchen back here, cutting board. People can get the sandwiches and the orders and stuff ready right here. Space for cashiers and all that good stuff. Yeah, this is nice. This is nice. Definitely is perfect for um, role playing on 5M on your server. Yeah, I like the pictures on the wall though. Those are yeah, those are great. I like those. And um, on the side, as you can see, we have a side entrance also, so we can kind of like drive our cars, park in the back, and uh, enter in through the back door and be ready to serve people. <laughs> That's right. Well. That is going to wrap it up for me and Frank. If this helped y'all out to install it or if you just enjoyed the video, feel free to smash that like button. Definitely subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. And share the video with your friends that are in the modding GTA 5. Y'all, this is Games of Graphics. Me and Big Ball and Ass Frank, we finna try to get some money at a hot dog stand, man. Till next time. I ain't scared of you motherfuckers.